Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Snacks from Around the World. Now today I'm going to uh, be just doing a little review on some sweets, these like, little candy things that I picked up from my local Asian supermarket. Now something I wanted to say just before I get into this, this the, the review and this video is that I'm, I'm thinking this would be quite a regular video that I want to do every now and again. Not, you know, I don't want to do one all the time so that it gets boring or whatever. But what I was thinking is, um, if you have any suggestions of snacks and stuff that are a little bit unusual um, that you want me to uh, to try and talk about it on video, uh, let me know in the comments um, or tweet me. You know the deal, Sherlock Bones. Jo uh, no, just Sherlock Bones. Replace the E's with threes. Um, and I'm, what I was also thinking about was. It doesn't have to be from an Asian supermarket. It can be from anywhere, any shop, any any wherever you want to get your stuff from, or wherever I can get hold of things. Or if you want to send me things, just get in in, in contact and stuff like that. Uh, but I was thinking maybe if you found found something in your in, a, in your local supermarket or shop that you thought, oh, that looks a bit weird, you know, let me know about it and I'll uh, I'll. Um, give it a go and uh, talk about it. Now today we have these which are I think they're pretty popular I mean even I was talking to to my my mom the other day and she she remembers these from from, from her childhood um, and um, I think from what I can uh, make out is these I'm probably gonna get this really wrong but I think these are Japanese that's probably wrong, isn't it? I don't know. But these are the white rabbit candies. You can see them there. Uh, the light's a bit reflecting off it. But uh, packaging, as always, pretty pretty funky. Um, so let's get into these and let's give them a try. S they smell really good. Kind of, it kind of got like a a fudgy kind of smell. Really, they smell, you know, they smell sweet and sugary already. So, let's get one out. So, look at it. Little white rabbit. See that? Okay. Open it up. They kind of look like that. Kind of like a, a milky, creamy white. Um, it's pretty hard. It's really hard actually. And the smell is the same. Jesus. I'm gonna even chew it. Oh. Not good if you have fillings. Like I have loads of fillings. But very sweet. Hmm. Hmm. Pretty cool, actually. I like I quite like the taste. I'm not very. Uh, I'm not usually like a, a sweet type of person, but uh, I'm gonna get used to it. Uh, very creamy, very sugary. I'd compare it to um, like a really milky toffee, like a Highland toffee, or a, I mean. Do you remember those blocks of toffee you used to get? We used to have to hit it with a tiny hammer. That's kind of uh, kind of the texture. Hmm. All right. I'm gonna give that. Uh, I'm gonna give that. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say a five. Five out of ten. I'm um, again not very much of a sweet kind of person, but I can see why people enjoy them. Um, I think I, I bought that for about one pound or something, one pound sterling English money. So um, yeah, that's my sorry. That's my 
review of the, the white rabbit candy sweets um, this oh let's quickly go through the ingredients shall we liquid maltose sugar condensed milk whole milk powder butter gelatine vanilla and cornstarch the dreaded cornstarch so there you go that's my little review of the white rabbit candy sweets um you can follow me on twitter like i said before it's sherlock bones replace the e's with threes leave a comment below subscribe all that kind of stuff um tell your friends retweet all that kind of stuff and uh see you next time on snacks from around the world